So we've been talking about stroke. Let's say you've had one. What happens then? Not just in the acute care, but afterwards. Joining me now is Dr. Balbueno, who is the medical director for the Willis Knighton Rehabilitation Institute. What does that mean? I'm a board certified physical medicine specialist. At the Rehab Institute, uh, that is just a, a snapshot of what's available to you after you have a stroke. So when you start, you're already into the stroke realm where, where you are going to get the uh, utmost care. Your social worker, your physicians will determine what type of therapy that you will need and then provide you with the services that you need. Here's one thing I want to know. A lot of times we think stroke, oh my goodness, awful, bad, can't right. recover. Right. Let's give people some hope. We can't take the stroke away. It's happened. Um, but what we can do moving forward is we can learn about stroke prevention, and we do this in rehab. We learn about stroke preventative medications, stroke preventative diets, and we make the patient empowered so that even though they had this stroke and we teach families, we get them prepared for what's next. It's awesome to hear that there's hope and there's mm -hmm. significant help not just at the, at the point of inception, but right. through each phase of the right. process. Thank you so much for taking the time. And again, just a reminder, since May has been Stroke Awareness Month, all of these tips are something that may help you or your family. For KTBS3, I'm Community Projects Director Jan Elkins.